Hi guys and welcome back to Owen J Gaming and your me Ollie and today we are back with another Yu-Gi-Oh character deck and this time it is Rex Raptor complete deck so I have made this deck as complete as possible I have added three cards I have duplicated some cards and I have substituted a card because to make it as as uh, as realistic to a Rex Raptor deck as possible, I've looked is from all the anime, maybe not the manga, but you can comment below if I've missed some cards out. But if you want to make a original Rex Raptor deck, I would suggest uh, watching this video, and I will explain why this is a as closely as possible to Rex Raptor's deck as possible. Sorry, I'm talking too much. <laughs> uh, so, shall we start with the first cards? All right, then it's dino feeding time. So we got here is Crawling Dragon 2. Um, he's, this is against Joey, he's used that. Mega Zola. Um, actually, Mega Zola, there is another name for this card. Um, but in the anime, but in real life, it's called Megazola. Got Red Eyes Black Dragon. That's why Rex Raptor had the Red Eyes Black Dragon. The Red Eyes Black Dragon! Ah! A what dragon? If you aren't familiar and you think Joey was the one who has Red Eyes Black Dragon, no, it originally belonged to Rex Raptor, but Rex Raptor, um, in his confidence against Joey, he bet his dragon and Joey bet his time wizard and Joey won by fossilizing the dragon and winning Red Eyes Black Dragon. I put it in the deck, the reason why I put it in this deck, because it was originally Rex Raptor's card, not Joey's. Joey won it off him, yes, but it was originally Rex Raptor's. Next we've got Serpent Knight Dragon, Sword Arm of Dragon, um, Trachodon, Two-Headed King Rex, Herbabai, Giant Rat, and two, two Glacosaurus, Trident Dragon, he does get near the end of the series. Polarization, we'll get back to Polarization in a minute actually. Bottomless Trap Hole, Balloon Lizard, Black Torano, and something about Black Torano, what I did not realise until watching Yu-Gi-Oh! back, I thought Black Torano first came out in Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. That's what my I always thought that it only came out then. But no, came out near the end of Yu-Gi-Oh! and Rex Raptor had Black Torano. So that was quite surprising for me. You may know, already knew, I did not. I completely, I probably completely forgot about that. Next we've got Ultra Evolution Pill. So before we move on to the rest of the cards, these are the cards what I did my research on and that's all we got from his deck is just these cards. That's it from his deck. So how how do I complete the deck with just um, just these cards, 17 cards? It doesn't work. It really doesn't work. So I have added some cards here as I'll show you now. I've added a Monster Reborn because it fits the theme of the original Yu-Gi-Oh. I've added two Pots of Greed. Yes, they're banned now, but think about it. Back then, there was no banned list. There was no cards like that, so they were not banned. So if you want to make this deck and you don't care about the banned list, I would suggest adding Pot of Greed because it's an old school card. But if you want to play it now, I would suggest changing them for something different. Something different. I just put them in because they're old school, and that's why. But if you want to make it um, 
legal and you want to go by the band list, I would change them. Next, I added Wasteland because in uh, Jordan's Kingdom, they played on a field spell, field zone. So I added two Wastelands to help with his dragon, with his dinosaurs, sorry. And right now, coming to the duplication, I've added two more Crawling Dragon 2s. Two more of those. We'll come to that in a minute. We've got another two Dracodon and another two, he two headed King Rex. And two uh, by another two Giant Rat, but then two I really needed. Another Glacosaurus, two Polarizations. Two Botanus trap holes, two balloon lizards, and another ultra evolution pill. So, as you can see, I have duplicated it because he did not have a complete deck. So, I just duplicated and then added uh, three cards, three new cards. So, that is his deck there. So, shall we go on to the fusion? So, the fusion is actually quite interesting. I replaced this because he had a fusion, here it is, Horned Saurus, but it, it, it does not exist, it, it just does not exist at all, so um, I thought I'd look into it and I found a card that fits this deck perfectly, Braco Radius, reason why, because it needs two headed King Rex, when we got there, and Crawling Dragon two what we've got there so it works perfect with this deck i did not have to add any cards to to it what well, makes it perfect for this deck i personally think next we have got the seal of oi calcos i'm sorry if i've said that wrong but it's not in his deck reason why he was given it in the walking dragon series of Yu -Gi Oh. so it's not actually part of his deck but it was used by him so i put it in down here in the side deck that's a card you don't need to actually get if you want to make a rex raptor deck so these are the cards what have not been released but were in the anime and were in his deck so we've got here is kappa top terror i'm sorry if i said that wrong chain of the underworld jurassic heart Horned Saurus and Dragon Nail. These are cards what have not been released but might get released in the future. You never know. Um, Yu Gi Oh is always changing, so they might bring them out in the future. But they haven't at the moment, so you're welcome to like print them out and make your own Rex Raptor deck with these cards. But they were not released in real life, so I could not add them into this deck. So, yes. Um, this is the most complete deck I could come across without adding new cards and making it completely not his. I wanted it as authentic as possible and I think I have done that. But if you ha can think of any cards he used and I missed out what was in that anime, please comment below and I'll try and add them because I, I always need feedback. So there is now a, a video, there will be a video coming out soon of um, Weevil Underwood versus Rex Raptor. We saw them a little bit, we saw Weevil win in episode 2, um, season 1 episode 2 of Yu-Gi-Oh! But we never actually saw a full match. So I'm, I'm going to do a full match with a lot of editing, what will be really fun and I, I, I'm looking forward to do. So I don't know when that's coming out because the editing might take a while, but I think it'll be fun to do. Anyway, um, if you really like this video and you want to give this a thumbs up, that'd be very appreciated. Sus um, subscribe if you want to, um, and if you want this deck, but you don't, you can actually download this deck in the description. So I'm going to put this in the description where you can download it. I made it so you can download it and you can put it on Yu-Gi-Oh Pro, on Jewelist Nexus, what I'm using now. This is Jewelist Nexus or any other Yu-Gi-Oh um, card programs. You can. There will be a Word document coming soon 
but not quite yet. So that's why I've got the download deck if you want it now. So again, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and consider subscribing. That would be very appreciated. And I will see you again for another Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu -Oh! video or tomorrow for a Pokemon pack opening. Uh, uh, I will see you then.